enterprises can face data corruption of their Microsoft Exchange Server database, which often requires recovery from a backup. NetApp Snap Center 4.1 introduces the Reseed feature, which provides the ability to quickly and easily recover this failed replica from a backup snapshot copy. When Microsoft Exchange Server runs in a database availability group configuration, there can be a situation where one of the replica goes into a failed or suspended state. When this condition occurs, you will need to reseed this failed replica back to a healthy state. The time required for reseed depends on the size of the database and network performance. Snap Center makes DAG reseeding go many times faster since Snap Center reseed operation uses the NetApp Snap Restore technology to perform a restore from local backup snapshot copies. In order to showcase this reseed feature, I'm going to first have to manually suspend one of the replicas in the DAG. So first, let's browse to the Exchange Admin Center, click on Servers, Databases, select a suitable database, and browse to suspend a specific replica in this database availability group. So click on Suspend and specify comments that we're testing Snap Center reseed operation and click on save. As a result of this, this replica shows as passive suspended. To perform the reseed operation, let's go back to Snap Center, click on resources, ensure the Microsoft Exchange Server plugin is selected in the drop down. From the database view, select DB1 and the topology page displays a list of available backup snapshots for this database. Select the most recent backup snapshot copy and click on Reseed. Select the database copy that is in the failed or suspended state which needs to be reseeded and click on Next. In the host window, select the host from whose backup you want to reseed and click Next. Optionally, specify the pre or post scripts that need to be run before or after the reseed operation. Click Next. You have the option to configure email settings to notify users about the status of the reseed operation. Click Next. Review the Summary tab with details for the reseed operation and click Finish. You can view this newly submitted reseed job in the activity panel. You can click on that specific job to view more details of the currently running reseed operation. Once the Snap Center reseed completes, we can go back to the Exchange Admin Center and confirm the status of this database replica, which now shows as passive healthy as a result of the reseed. As you can see, NetApp Snap Center reseed operation is much faster since we leverage the NetApp Snap Restore technology to reseed the passive replica from a backup snapshot copy.